Hello, everybody. I'm your host, Eric Bird, here at StopStrugglingNow.com. And today, I have to talk about something that I haven't talked about in a while. It's Laramar City and Resort in Punta Cana, Dominican Republic, otherwise known as Veron, near Punta Cana in Dominican Republic. The reason why I have to make this announcement is simple. There are some people that have contacted me today, more than a few, that asked me about something that they saw on Instagram. And they were saying, is this happening? Is this for real? It looks like it's going down. What does that mean? Well, stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen, and I'm going to show you what they're talking about, and you can determine for yourself. But once again, welcome. Stop struggling now, gear. Check. And please like, subscribe, and click the bell below so you get the latest updates. Now, let's get to it. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, and once again, I want to thank you so much for being here, and please share the videos so other people can find out about everything that we do here in the SSN Nation. Everybody on podcast, also share. Everybody listening to the sound of my voice, share, 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 and you know where to come. Stop struggling now on YouTube podcast page, and speaking of that, that's where we're headed at right now. You'll notice a few members of the channel, courtesy of YouTube, are shown over here on the right-hand side. I thank them so much for their little financial amount for joining, and because they join under the community tab, they receive special messages directly from me to them. They also receive one or two videos per month. They also can join me on any live stream, anyone, and on Wednesday night, only members with the icon can be in the chat room. Everybody can watch on Wednesday nights, but Monday, Wednesday, Friday night scheduled live streams, only Wednesday night, we're members are the only ones that can be in the chat room. Monday and Friday, everybody can be in the chat room. Now, without further ado, what am I talking about? Laramar, on their story feed on Instagram, it actually showed that it said, ready soon, or something to that effect. So what I'm going to do is show people exactly what other people have seen. Because I tell everybody, go to Laramar City Instagram page so you get the actual updates. So what I'll show you here is a few posts. Here goes some reels. Again, renderings, commercial, not showing anything. Renderings, renderings for months. So, today, when things popped up on their story feed, this is what it kind of looked like. So you can see right here where people would get excited. See this? Look at this. People would think that this is some sort of improvement. But, I digress. This is not actually a post by Laramar. This is a post by a realtor. Making it seem like something was going down at Laramar because their vested interest is to make sure they are selling something to you. A dream, so to speak. We almost ready 100 with the Dominican flag. People are getting excited going, Eric, what's happening, man? I can't believe it. Okay, you see that tall grass in the background? Do you see any cranes out there? Do you see any foundations out there? All right. Do you see Laramar posting any pictures? That's all you need to know. So you need to contact them if you are interested in finding out what's going on. All right. I'm just saying, I'm not the guy I promoted. I thought they were going to be the guys that was going to make things happen, make things right. They do have the right contract or had, but does it really matter? So here we are. People are now still who invested, 
are sitting there saying, wow, maybe they have something going on. Well, I just wanted to say that is not the case. There is nothing new that they have reported under the sun other than making some press releases. Press releases do not count anymore, especially for people who have payment plans. So once again, email them, contact them directly or stay in touch with their Larimar City Instagram page because I don't know of any other platform that they might even post anything. So just making sure that everybody here understands and is very clear, I'm upset about it. Just to be clear, in case you missed the memo, missed the videos earlier, because I actually took down videos that had to do with Larimar. All right, so let's just call it what it is. And let's add the last thing, because on live streams, everybody knows. Maybe people don't know here. Yes, I requested a refund. Have I received it? Hell no. But I'm still asking. All right? So that should give you the level of confidence now that you can roll forward with or not. Because everybody invests based on things that are going to be delivered in certain time frames. So no problem. There may be an issue, clearly, because they're not building out there. So therefore, what can we tell you? And that video may or may not be from yesterday or today. I don't know when that video is, but let's just say it is today, July 17th. Again, a fence around something does not mean something is being built and somebody saying something like, we're almost ready. Unless you hear it directly from the horse's mouth, that's when you should be contacting them. You can contact me still, but I'm just saying, I just call it what it is. Until I see foundation and buildings being done, then you can come ask Eric, what do you think? And I'm telling you, you guys already know what I think, so I'm not going to delve into it anymore. Like I said, as far as I'm concerned, they can just do whatever they want to do, and I just want out. So with all that said, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. And please like, subscribe, and click the bell below so you get the latest updates. And it's hard out here, ladies and gentlemen. Especially when there's money to be made when the stock market doubles in the last four years. When there's money to be made in other ventures and having money sitting somewhere like a bank account, like doing pre-construction where you have it sitting there for years and not being able to tap into it and losing money in retrospect if things aren't done on time. That is not a good position to be in. All right, let's get real out here. A lot of people, 70% of the nation in America is living paycheck to paycheck. So just keep that in mind. And that's why a lot of people spending their hard-earned money, it's major on an investment. So whether you invest in a crypto project, whether you invest in stocks, whether you invest in any real estate, whether you invest in whatever, baseball cards, collectibles, whatever you invest in, Gold and silver, you're still hoping to get some return for your money. So just be careful out here. Make sure you do your own due diligence the best you can. And with all that said, keep your head up, keep moving, and I'm out.